All right, I just got done doing a nice wheeling trip up in Colorado. Hemi did great, transmission did great, Jeep did great. Kept the herd a lot of this. So let's see what we can do to stop that. Here I have the metal cloak control arms. They recommend yearly taking them apart and re-greasing them up. I think I'm on about two years, but uh, this also isn't my daily driver. It sat for a while doing the Hemi swap. So let's get to, uh, let's, let's get these squeaks taken care of. A few moments later. All right, and then this is after Greasing it up. No noise. All right, so now that you know the benefits, let's show you how to get it done. First, you need a set of snap ring pliers. You need some rags. You need the grease supplied by Metal Cloak or purchased from Metal Cloak. Screwdriver, this is just to make sure the snap rings are in all the way. Use a bottle of uh, Royal Purple and uh, you know, wrenches to take off the control arms, but uh, that's kind of a given. So we'll start here taking the snap ring out. And just do everything on both sides, same time. socket and press out the other press the bushing out here's the first washer if it gets a little hard get a rubber mallet Okay, once you do that, there's also some O-rings, there's some uh, washers inside on both sides. You'll notice the shiny side and then the kind of the rusted or the, you know, the zinc coated side. The zinc coated side touches the lock washer. The shiny side touches the actual bushing. You'll see inside here, it's uh, a little bit dirty. We need to clean that out. All right, next you can clean off all the washers and the lock rings. Now you can clean out, wash out the actual pushing. Okay, you can, if you can see it in camera, you can see part of it looks like it's wearing away, part of the actual bushing. It's not as smooth. Same with on this side. But the actual uh, sides of it, where he kind of does this flexing, that's all still one solid piece. Um, this is from not doing maintenance as often as I probably should. I think it starts to, instead of slip, starts to kind of 
grab a little bit more and wear some of the, the rubber down. So, yeah, but it's still fine. All right, next you take the supplied grease. Don't use other grease, only use what's supplied or what Metal Cloak recommends. Don't use just random grease. Lubricate the whole bushing. And then you can take a little bit extra and try to just put a little bit extra in these little grooves. One thing I forgot, don't forget to put the bushing or the washer in before you put the actual bushing in there. Clean side goes towards the, uh, the bushing. snap ring. Get ready to put it back in. Take your screwdriver. Give it a little tap. Just like that. It snaps into place. Same thing on this side. All right, already snapped right into place. You know it's seated all the way down. Just like that, it's done. Ready for reinstall. Now we just have oh, six more to do. Fun, fun, fun.